Hey guys, me Seeking Simulator here today, and today we are back with update two on the Armor S Imperia. And yes, I am done with B deck, and and of course it's not just B deck, and I also added a lot more details than I did with the uh, last video. And here we have the Armor S Imperia, which B deck is complete, and yeah, it has lots more details. And I also finished the bridge. Sorry, my cat's in here. He wants to be in here. And so yeah, lots of de lots of progress done than the previous one. Of course, you can, or also you can notice that there's more details on navigation deck. And and yeah, lots of details. And so yeah, we're just gonna begin from bow to stern. Um, and so yeah, we're gonna begin with the bridge. And yeah, if I can fly there even faster. <laughs> so. I will be making the sister ships as well to these ships. So yeah, the sister ships are going to be the Utopia and the Su and the Salvia. And of course, most of them are mostly uh, years apart. This one was built 1899. The Utopia was built 1900, and the Sylvania was built in 1903. And of course, this was before the Adriatic. And of course, after during the Adriatic, I mean. No, this was the largest ship before uh, Adriatic came around. It was up until Adriatic. This was the largest ship in the world. But this is custom, so don't believe me. Blah, blah, blah. And of course, yeah. I'm sorry, I get sidetracked. And right here we have the bridge. We have the telegraphs, um, the phones, uh, telemotors, and lots of gauges and stuff. And of course, it looks a lot like Mauritania's. And yes, I meant to look like. I meant to look, make it look like Mauritania's. And of course, we have the chart room. And yes, it's just a simple chart room. And of course, we have the wheelhouse with the skylight and the helm and some alarm whistle. One whistle is used for, like, uh, I mean, the telegraph's used for the whistle and different modes, and usually the firearm, uh, fire alarm, not firearm. Oh god, I wonder what that would be used for. <laughs> so, this the the fire alarm would be used to, to negate if the ship's on fire or not. And of course we have the watertight um, gauges to indicate to clo either close or open the watertight bulkheads. And of course we have the phones to, to signal um, from the crow's nest all the way from the bridge. So yeah, and this is the officer's mess, and of course, yeah, it looks nice. And we have the fourth and fifth officer, and of course I did not forget about the fourth and the fifth officer. And yeah, that, and that is it for um, the bridge. And so we got that down, so yeah, we got that done pretty quickly. And we have B-Deck. And not much has no, uh, changed, really. And of course, I added uh, support beams like Mauritania's, identical to Mauritania's. And we have the first class entrance. And of course, it is basically the same thing as A deck. And we have rooms with uh, suites, actually. Yeah, not much. I mean, nice. Yeah, there's nice cabins. Nice sweets and yeah, yeah. And, and one thing I keep forgetting is to label these. Yeah, I forgot to label them. I, I am 100% sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, kind of last minute things right here. Even doing it at the last minute when I'm doing this video. And, of course, we have the stairs that goes up from A deck to B deck. And, of course, we have... The, the 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 grand staircase and so yeah it's the grand stair i mean i mean it's just a staircase yeah and we have the purse's baru which which is a um room to store jewelry and um items that are worth much more to you and this is where they keep it in and so yeah lots of details lots of things so yeah and let's go to the um, 
This is the um, lawn gallery. And we have one on the other side as well. So yeah, it's always hunky-dory. And of course I had like light switches, so do not tamper with. And we have the first class cabins. We have women's, a bathroom right here. And cabins, more cabins, yeah. And of course we have like this little room right here. Little uh, machinery room. Oops, uh, right here. Um, there we go. And then, um, then we have the barber shop. Yes, and this is a very important room. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I'd call this room important though, but it's a really nice room. I mean, I added some details and made it look nice. Not so not much. And then we have the electric baths. And of course, an electric bath is the most terrifying machine I've ever seen from the 1900s. I mean, the electric bath is just basically a tanning bed, but a basically a pre-tanning bed. All it does is just produces heat and warms up your body and let the skin skin cancer grow before your very eyes. And so, <laughs> so yes, as you notice on the sign, you must have a premium. So if you don't have a premium, and it's then you can go suck a big one. And we have the ele electric bath number one. And of course, yeah, it's just an electric bath. You put your whole body in here, and you basically just have a nice tan. And of course, we have a second one as well. And yeah, it also has a window. I don't know why. Why not? And yeah, and that is it for the first class. So a lot of it's cabins and yeah, not much. And then we get to second class. And of course, I did a lot with second class. I didn't first off, I didn't even show a second class um staircase from the boat deck. And of course, before as you noticed that there was a elevator um built box, I mean like a superstructure thing to support the um the elevator shafts and gears so that is no longer there because we want to, st to stick it to the normal timeline and yeah and of course this as a um yeah so before this was just elevators right here but that is no longer there anymore and it's just an open spiral staircase and of course yeah this is supposed to be painting of uh of beautiful Michigan scenery <laughs> and yeah and of course we go down to uh, the B deck landing on the, the staircase and of course we have these uh, second class lounge and of course I base this off of the actual second class lounge off Titanic and Lusitania's as well but Lusitania's was on boat deck but this one's on a deck hmm interesting but yeah of course, we have bathrooms right here, and uh, women's on the other side, and yes, and this door is going to take us to the smoking room. And yes, looks really identical to Lusitania's, and yes, that is my inspiration for this smoking room. Is Lusitania's floor, same coloring, same type of tone of uh, wood, and I apologize for the lag, honestly. I don't even know what's going on. And of course, we got the, uh, I didn't even bother to show this room. Uh, this room is just, uh, I should really flip this the other way. Oh god. Uh, kill me. Uh, there we go. And we're just gonna, yeah. And yeah, that is it. I mean, for this room, I guess. Yeah, and this room is just a steering wheel. I mean a helm. Oh my god, what did I call it? a steering wheel? God, it's my bad. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. I forgot to show off the uh, second class Kevin's, but... But one more thing before we do, I am going to go into the crew areas that lead down to the maids and valets room. I mean, mess. God. And of course, Titanic did have this in the Olympic class. And of course, we have a galley. Yeah. And that's all I wanted to show you in this part. 
Mm. And yeah. <clears throat> and where it starts the second class cabins and is right here, right next to this expansion joint. And let's go inside. Another electricity. Do not tamper with, or else you will die of cancer. No, just kidding. That's not something to joke about. Just kidding. And also, we got this is a second class cabin. Very detailed for a second class cabin. And of course, you got the same thing throughout the whole entire ship. I mean, not through the whole entire ship, the whole entire second class areas. And yeah, and basically, that's it. I mean,. There's not really much to see on B deck. I mean, just lots of cabins, lots of work. This took me, I mean, B deck took me a couple days to finish. I mean, it's kind of fast. I don't know. It's a decent amount of time done. And, oh my gosh. Did that, did that three, one, oops. Did that three days feel like forever, man? I mean, the first few days, I, it was like one third of it, like, no, like, one fourth of it done. And then the second day was like halfway done, and then the third day was like got the other half done, which was second class in second class public areas. And yeah, lots of it done. No. And of course, <clears throat> I don't. Wait. Oh yeah, I did show the Marconi room. So, yeah, as as you may notice that I did add vents on through uh on the boat deck to ventilate the down below so yeah you need can mix ha mix it have more detail and this is the stairs the so the passengers can come up on the the navigation deck and look at the beautiful scenery which is uh, lusitania not rendered <coughs> and of course i did add uh a uh, little platform with the whistles to add more detail and I can't wait to start C deck I mean this is gonna be a lot of work I mean just lots of work I mean you got C deck D deck and E deck and you got tank top deck as well and yeah I mean this ships gonna have like two two other sister ships I mean yeah, I mean, they're just going to have different traits and different, oh my god, what did I say traits? I mean, diff some differences uh, between the two. I mean, between the three sister ships. Oh my gosh. And, yeah, and I think that's about it. I mean, there's not much to really show on uh, the Imperia. So, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Feel free to subscribe and comment and like on the video. And if you want to see me more do videos, uh, oh my god. If you want to see me do more videos, yeah, just subscribe and do whatever. I mean, yeah, I want to make this a bustling channel again. So, I mean, it was like a ghost town for months on end. And now, I just, it's coming back. It's coming back to a booming channel. And most of my viewers are going to come back. And, yeah. And, oh, wait. I want to point this out. Um, I also did add uh, little details on the... Uh, on the rudder like little rivets for detail and of course I am probably not gonna add rivets on the hole I mean uh, just imagine how much it will lag I mean it's gonna be crazy I mean either than that hope you guys enjoy and yeah so yeah see ya and yeah yeah just okay. just pretend that outro failed never happened so yeah just so see ya